Hey, I'm Ryan Van Ruckel, Pioneer Agronomist in Southern Iowa. Getting a lot of questions this time of year, what our beans are going to yield. Uh, they got pretty good color, pretty good height in a lot of places. Out here we've got a little bit of Japanese beetle and a little bit of frog eye, but looks pretty good. Now when it comes to yield, you got to look down below, okay? You got to pull up some of these plants and start looking at some of the pots. Now this is a pretty good plant, so be careful about that. Make sure you're not pulling the big one out there. You look at several of these. Uh, but there's quite a few pods up and down this, which is showing me pretty good yield potential. Now if you do the math, you can actually get out a yield estimate. Alright, let's do the math quick. Yield is bushels per acre equals... Plants per acre times number of pods per plant times the number of seeds per pod. So divide that by the number of seeds per pound, and then there's pounds per bushel. And then all these cancel out, and you're left with bushels per acre. I think you know you did it right. So, for plants, let's use 140,000. Let's use uh, pods per plants, what we're trying to calculate. We'll do an average two and a half seeds per pod. We'll do 2,900 seeds per pound, 60 pounds in a bushel. What happens there then, for each pod, that's equal two bushel per acre, all right? Now, each one of these factors is important. So let's say you've only got 100,000 plants. Well, then a pod's gonna equal about a one and a half bushel per acre. Uh, let's say you got monster seeds here. You got 2,300 seeds per pound. Well, then a pod is going to actually equal closer to two and a half bushel per acre. And then be careful which pod you're counting. All right. So some of these small ones at the bottom, uh, these one bean ones, you go ahead and skip those. You're only wanting to count the good ones. And then when you get up to the top, this plant's just R5, but there's a lot of small pods here that it has not committed to yet. So you got to be really careful about those. I skipped all of those. Uh, of course, the closer you get to harvest, you'll know exactly what pods are there and which ones have aborted, and you can get a lot better idea there. So if you're out and you're curious about your beans, make sure you get into them. Go look at those pods. Thanks. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.